Today I'm going to show you how to use Destiny Quest, our online library uh, catalog, and uh, I'm going to show you how to search for a book in it. So the first thing we're going to do is every uh, computer here in the library opens up to our Ponderosa High School web page. You're just going to click on library here and that'll take you to our library web page. Okay? You can kind of explore this on your own, but I'm going to show you how to get to Destiny Quest. You're going to go to our library re resources and uh, a couple of tabs uh, are underneath that. You're going to go to library catalog. And under here it says there's two ways you can uh, search the library catalog, Destiny Quest and Destiny Catalog. I prefer you use Destiny Quest just because it's a little bit more dynamic and a uh, more visually appealing way to be able to search the library catalog. So we're going to click on that and this brings up Destiny Quest. Okay, So um, there's lots of fun things you can do on here but I'm going to show you the basics of just how to search for a book. So let's say we're looking for The Fault in Our Stars, but we don't know who it's by. And all the fiction is organized by author's last name. So we need to find out who the author is. So all we have to do is just in up here on a search field, just type in The Fault in Our Stars. And there it is. We click on that, and it gives us a little bit of information about the book. It gives us information about what the book's about. There are some that don't give you this information about what the book's about, but um, a lot of them do. Um, it shows you uh, any kind of reviews that have been done for the book, like there's one review uh, that's been done in this book that gave it five stars, so we can see kind of what other high school students think of it. Um, if we click on reviews, you can read a little bit here about what the reviews say. I wrote this review here, so there's that. Um, it tells you how many of those books are available. Um, right now it says we have three out of five available. Uh, and uh, it also gives you a suggestion of other books you may like if you like this book. So that's kind of a good way to be able to uh, search for SSR books. If you know you like The Fault in Our Stars and you're looking for something else that's similar, you type it in, you search it, and then you can take a look and see what else you may like. And then if you just click on these, it'll take you to the other books. Okay? Um, another cool thing uh, that you can do through Destiny Quest is you can do this title peek. If I click on that, it'll give us just a little bit of a preview of what the book is about. So it'll show us the cover. It'll give us a little bit of a summary, who the characters are in it, um, the genre that it is, um, the topics that it covers, the setting of it, the time period. So that can give you a lot of good information about the book before you start reading it. Um, and then uh, on here also will give you any kind of reviews. So there's a couple of reviews on here. And uh, sometimes it gives you a preview of the book as well. Let me show you one that has an excerpt. Uh, I know Perks of Being a Wallflower has one. So if I go to the title peak for uh, Perks of Being a Wallflower, we get the same kind of stuff, summary, genre, characters, any kind of reviews. But then we get an excerpt of the first chapter. So we can kind of take a look and read a little bit and, uh, and see if it appeals to us. So the title peak is something that can be um, really good for you um, to get an idea of what the book's about. Uh, what you can also do is you can also press this shelf browse here and what the shelf browse will do is it, it virtually browses the shelf for you. So it will show you what other books are around this one so when you're searching for the book you can kind of find things perhaps a little bit more easily. So, uh, so yeah, that's it. That's how you search for books in Destiny Quest. There's a lot more things you can do once you learn how to log in, but we're going to learn that in just a moment. So that's it.